Hey guys, Jamie here today on Roblox, we're playing some more Pokemon Fighters EX. As you can see on screen now, finally got an update, uh, there's, I believe, um, Snorus Evolution line, including the Mega Galaleite, which is gonna be pretty cool. We have, and also we have Cry Cryogonal, which, um, is also in the game. Today I'm gonna show off the, uh, Snorus Evolution line, I don't have the Mega Galaleite yet, so what I'm thinking of doing is showing it off a maybe a separate video for the Mega Galele if I can get it in this one. But honestly, since I have to level up the Galele, I'm hoping that I can get it before this comes out. If not, I might do a Cryogonal and upload that one first, although I'm recording this video before that one, which is confusing. But oh well. But anyway, for the snow run, we have to do a new quest which is in the game, which is gonna be pretty good. So let's go over there real quickly and go get that quest dad. I know exactly where the NPC is. I've already unlocked the Cryogonal. Because I exit um because I accidentally fell into the um, the pit in this ice area and uh, I got it. So yeah, I was kind of looking for the um, NPC to be able to try and find out how to get this snow run started or get any clues about it before I start this recording. Don't really know anything about it, so we're going in with it blind, I guess. Um, and actually, I went over the bridge, accidentally fell in, got the cryogonal, even though I, it was kind of obvious. It says, um, meet your icy desire, which that's kind of like the only thing that can relate to getting killed by ice. But anyway, here is Jack, the NPC for the for the new one. It says, hello, called out here, huh? Would you mind starting a fire, brr? So there, there we go. Be quick, I will make it worth your while. So we need to probably become a fire type Pokemon, I would assume. So we might need flamethrower though. Maybe, I'm gonna evolve into Charizard because I'm pretty sure I unlocked Moose or Charizard, right? No, I haven't. Okay, we probably need, like, Flamethrower or a fire type move in general. Not 100% sure, but we're going to try and do this just randomly, because, I mean, these quests are usually easy. Well, I say usually. Some of the quests I actually have, like, the Nurse Joy one, we have to go underground to be able to find her. Wait, this gets Drain Claw by level up. I forgot about that. Because get Flamethrower, because I'm pretty sure we probably need that. At least that's what I'm thinking in my head. So that seems logical. Now for the Mega Glalieite, or the Mega Glalie Stone, or the Glalite, it, I'm gonna assume it spawns in one of these biomes. Now it's technically an ice type, there's no snow types obviously in the game at all. So I'm assuming it spawns around here, but it could also spawn in the snow one. I'm not 100% sure, but let's go with Charizard up here. I fell off, great. Let me up, please. Again, slightly triggered. Just slightly. Do I have to use Flamethrower on the... On this? No. Once I've talked to him now. No. So, this wasn't the right thing to do? It says start a fire. Maybe I have to use Flamethrower on him. Which would be very stupid. Maybe Flamethrower isn't the way to go. What would be the other one? Overheat? Okay. Maybe, maybe it's not Flamethrower. Unless I have to stand on it. Okay, maybe it's not Flamethrower then. I can't talk to him anymore either. What else can I use then? Um, what other Pokemon could I use? Sunny Day probably isn't the right thing to use. What the fight? Maybe Ember? Oh yeah, I forgot about some of the meshes not working on real blocks aside, so... On some Pokemon you're gonna see like invisible paths, and right now... <laughs> well, because of no legs, it's a freaking sausage. <laughs> okay, that's uh, pretty funny, okay. I mean, you can't say that's not pretty funny, look at that. <laughs> Is it missing his neck as well? It looks like it's missing a bit of its front. Okay, missing his legs, I can clearly see that, so that's, um, that's an amazing Pokemon right there. I want to evolve it, but I'm not sure if Ninetales even if my Ninetales even has Ember. Ember would seem like a good shout for a move, unless I need an item, which then, which might then make more sense. But I, I'm not 100 percent sure. Okay, no. Ember, I don't think that did anything. Maybe this. What am I meant to do? Ember. No. Jack. What am I meant to do? It says a fire. It says starts in a fire. Do I need to use a specific fire type move, or do I need like a specific item potentially? Um, maybe arc arc 
Arceus with the fire plate or the Genesect with the burn drive? Genesect. I doubt it's going to be Genesect to be honest, that would make no sense in my opinion. So we can try it. Okay, let's give it the burn drive. I also have no idea if I'm meant to like, have an item which I'm going to try this and try the Arceus one. If I don't get it with that, then I'm going to have to uh, get some help or just try and do it off camera until I realize where it is. Techno I mean, this could be a good shout, I'll just realize as well. Genesect has a few meshes that is invisible as well. I don't know how I just realized that after I've been running around a bit like, like a good 30 seconds now. But yeah, somehow I only just realized, oh I have quick attack. Yay. Okay, let's try and go up here and let's use Techno Blast. I doubt this will work. It didn't work. Okay, so it's not Genesect. I don't think it's going to be Arceus, to be honest, so let me think about this. Morning Sun? Probably not. Hmm. Maybe ho -Oh with Sacred Fire? Oh, wait, I don't have Sacred Fire, do I? No. Um, to be honest, it might be in, there might be like a, fi um, a, a lighter around the map somewhere or a fire starter, potentially. But Sacred Fire seems like it would be a smart decision. Since we're not going to try the Ar Arceus, I guess I'll try the Ho-Oh Sacred Fire. Or if I have see any other potential moves. So in a day, Fire Blast could be a good option. Oh, it doesn't even get Sacred Fire yet. It's not even in the game. Oh, I'll give it Fire Blast. Potentially Fire Blast. I don't think Sunday Day is going to be the right option, but I guess I'll give it to it anyway. I mean, potentially Weather Ball with Sunday Day up could be a, another option, but I doubt it. I'm trying to think of all the fight time moves. I don't know any. Oh, high scale. I just, I just used two, so I'll take that. But also, if you don't know, in this video, I'm, going to, I'm mainly just going to show off the... Um, the um how to get it i guess or how, how to get it and i guess i'll show you like all the evolution line and then i'll do like a shiny video for them all in the, when i actually get them Flint fire blast no sunny day and then use weather ball no okay i don't know Len. i'm gonna have to be back i'm gonna try a few more things if I can't, still can't figure out, I'm going to have to have someone, so I'll be back in a second. Okay, now I'm back, Lynn, so I've joined a new server, because it wasn't that I did it wrong, it's because there's a glitch, which is, which apparently is, like, fairly uncommon, but unfortunately for me, I ended up getting the glitch. So, Lynn, what the glitch was, was, you you are meant to use Ember, Flame for a Fire Blast, those are the three moves I know 100% work, since I've asked Oglipo. Those three moves 100% work, which I use every single one of those moves. The only problem is though, I didn't check the log to see where it wanted me to use next. Now it says talk to Jack, the only problem was, in the last clip that you saw, I clicked on him multiple times. Now the glitch was, it just wouldn't let you talk with him. Now Uglipo on Discord as I'm recording this just says that he's figured out what the causing the glitch, and by the time this video comes out it should be fixed. Hopefully. If you're still having problems with it, screenshot it and try and tweet at Uglypo and uh, give him like the screenshots and it definitely will help him because he might be able to like fix the glitch. So now we should be able to talk to him since we're in a new server, there we go, wait. Burr, thanks I'll be quick, it's worth your while. Oh wait, I just, I just talked to him. Can I talk to him again now? Or do I have to do, redo that entire process again that I just did? Lord Arceus is so cold out here, quick, oh wait. So now I have to do it all again and hope that I just don't get the glitch. Which, if I don't get it this time, I also just might just wait until it gets fixed, unless I just join multiple times, because apparently it's pretty uncommon to get. Although, knowing my luck, unfortunately, it's probably going to happen like 10 times in a row. But now we have Flamethrower. Flamethrower is one of the moves that 100% does work. Um, so there we go. But because he just said that in the last text, I wonder if um, Fireplay Arceus does work as well. I doubt it, to be honest, but... Could be worth a try, I guess, if anyone wants to go try it. I'm not going to try it because I really don't think it will, but... I mean, if you want to try it, I guess, then sure. Okay, now we should use Flamethrower on the fire. And it lit this time, so yes, it didn't glitch. Then return to Jack. So there we go. Ah, thank you, kind stranger, here as promised. So finally did it. 
So we did do it right the first time, just like the fire didn't blitz, so we just got a glitch. So it isn't with the NPC line that I see. It's with the fire pit. I hit the fire pit multiple times. I think... Actually, no. It's not the fire pit. It's because when I checked the log after I stopped recording, it just said, talk to Jack. Which I have said before I talked to him in this server, and that started the quest. So I think... I think the glitch is that the quest just doesn't start. I'm gonna have to tell upload that, but now that we've got the snow run, let's go quickly check it out. Um, snow run, oh, this is level 12. We need to just get to level 100 for the shine, so let's quickly check this out. So right now it's, oh, it's not invisible. Okay, good. Whew, that would be a little upsetting if it was. Okay, what level do we need to get, Lens? We need 42 for Glela, and we just need a female one for Frostlass, and I already have a Dawnstone, so here is the normal snow run, obviously. Which looks amazing. It looks like it's pretty, a lot bigger than I actually expected the snow run to look like. What's Ice Shard? Because I've never seen this game, or this in the game yet. I think that's a new move. Maybe. Or just I've never used Ice Shard before. But now I need to go level this thing up to level 100. Or level up for this video. So I can show you the evolutions to it. And then the next video, when I post for the um, Glalit, I'll show off the... Um, the Mega stone because I'm hopefully gonna get that also I'll show off the shiny version So this video is mainly just like trying to try show you How to get this Pokemon since also the people will be looking up that up and also they'll know see the video and they'll not learn how to do it But also in this video I'll show off the quickly the frost last and the Galera. So I'm gonna quickly despawn spawning back in as a female snow runs uh, Female it's kind of weird how it's only females that evolve into Frost last. I'm not hundred percent sure why, but wherever, because um, some people, because it is a ghost type, some people think that the Dawnstone kills the Snow Runts, making it be like re revive itself as a Frost last because it's a ghost type, obviously. Because Dawnstone, it, like, it kind of looks like a little bit of a fire, and you're melting it ice. So that's like the theory that people have. So killing off female Snow Runts to become a Frost last. Interesting. <laughs> but yeah, the, here is a Frost last. An amazing Pokemon, 110 base speed. I already know what this thing is. It is a special attack alone, not a physical attacker. So let's go see what moves it actually has since I used to level up anywhere. Oh, damn, we are slow. Come on, please. Please speed up. So apparently the Mega Stone, from what Ogrepo has said, is on the highest points where Snoran spawns. So it, I don't know if it could spawn in any of them or just the Ice one. So I'm going to try and find it out. I'm gonna see where the Mega Stone spawns, and if I get it, on ca and I'll, if I c can get it, I'll try and screenshot it so I can put it in a video. So that most likely be in the Mega Galela video. This one's how to get Snow Runt, obviously. So there we go. Let's go quickly have a look at the Muslo since I can, since I have a few uh, hard scales left. Plus I can just buy them, I guess. Which I keep forgetting that I can buy them, but oh well. Might as well get free ones while I can. Can I hop on? Get okay, Powder Snow. Probably not that needed. Will o Wisp is a pretty good move. I'll probably take that. He uh, Shadow Ball. Is good. Hail is pretty good as well. Ice Fang, Headbutt, Bite, not really that good. Destiny Bones is a move that I want though. Because it wants Z Crystal. Oh, wait, I forgot. Z Crystal's not in this game yet. They could definitely add those into the game. I mean, that should be fairly easy for them. I, I say easy. It should be easy for them to do. Just that yeah, it will take them a while to be able to do every single one. Because it include there's a ton of new moves, or a ton of moves. Although it, I, I definitely see how they could potentially do it, but Destiny Bond, because the Destiny Bond is like a priority move, although priority moves in this game don't exactly exist, so I'm not sure how that's going to work. So, yeah, but that's some pretty good moves. Don't see any special attacking ice type moves, or Blizzard isn't in the game yet, though, so rip around in that. So, yeah, there's no ice beam on it either because I think it's a level, no, that's a TM, not a level up move. So, there we go. Anyway, I'll be back in a second for when we get to level 42 so I can show off, off is it 41? It, if, I think it's 42 for the Galela, and I think we'll leave it off there, so I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, and we are back when so much level the snow runs to level 100. I haven't found the Mega Stone yet, clearly, because obviously I, I, I just don't have it in my bag, so rip only that. Oh, I actually thought that I did for a second the Glalite. No, I don't have the Glalite, but I do know where it spawned. So, in the game right now, where the Snow Runt has four spawn, lo spawn locations, it can spawn here, here, on the floor right around like here somewhere. 
and they can also spawn here. So that's all the spawn locations. That snow run has when you re when you spawn in the game, and the the same snow run spawn locations is where the Galileite spawn. So it's so I, what I would suggest doing is when you spawn just like spawning as any Pokemon and sit right up here. I can see all of these spawn locations, and that's where you can find the Mega Galele, uh, Mega Galele stone is around here. I'm probably just going to buy it because now I know where it is. So it's in this general location. So that's where the stone is. If you aren't able to afford it and buy it, then you can just go around there. But that is where it will spawn. Also, if you still don't know, since Salmons is still fairly new, um, Salmons like spawns in this area over here. It's kind of random, it's just like entirely in this location right around here. I think I found mine like right here, so Salmon Sight spawns like anywhere in this little box right there, so if you didn't know that. But anyway, let's quickly show off all of the um, evolutions to it, and then I think in the next video when I show off Snow Runs, I'll show off the Shiny Farms and then the Mega Glalie as well. So, and like I said, so that's how to get Snow Runs and I guess how to get the Mega Stone since I've now found out why. It's just like so sometimes it's a little bit glitchy, although. I've talked to Uglypo and um, now the, um, what's it called, the glitch has been fixed, he's said, told everyone in the Discord, which is amazing, so I ended up finding out the glitch, and I think I was right about it being that, the, just the quest, at first I thought it was, oh, um, the, the fire is not working, it's not, it's just that like the NPC just didn't start the quest at all, so yeah, but anyway, I show off all of the models really quickly, and so here is the snow runt. I've already shown off the frost last, but I guess we'll just do it anyway again. So let's try off the Galela first since I need to respawn back out for the frost last. So here is the Galela. Again, I'll show off Mega Galela in that in the, that video, but yeah, but there is the Galela. It's just like an ice ball with like horns. A weird design, I guess, but it's like an ice ball. <laughs> Oh, 25 Robux, a Poké Box. I think that's just by walking around again. That's like the only quest I, I, I uh, ever do now, so... Another quest, the daily tasks, I always do now, but... There's that, let's go quickly... Um, show off the... Uh, female and Frostlass. So let's quickly show off Frostlass. It'll quickly again, and then I'll end off there. So let's uh, actually see if we actually get a spawn, because it... I've been waiting, I got level 100 um, snow runs in the process and I still haven't found the mega stone unfortunately but again that there is the frost last so that is how to get that. Um, also I guess I'll quickly put it in the end of the video and I'll also do it on the cryogonal video. If you don't know how to get cryogonal, um, when you go into cryogonal like paid, let me just quickly show you cryogonal, it says to, before you unlock it like um, you have to meet a icy demise. So what you have to do for that one is that like, you just spawn in as anything. You come over to the ice biome. You come up here, and then what you just jump off, and that is your icy demise where you die, and that is how you unlock uh, Cryogonal. So there's that. Not sure if it's every single time. I think it is because I got on the first time, so it might be every time. It might take you a few times to try it, but there we go. But that is how to get Snowrunt, and I'll see you guys next time.